The family of a well-known San Antonio surgeon and cyclist looked the woman convicted in his death eye to eye this morning. And just as importantly, they were able to tell her the pain they've suffered. A judge then sentenced Melissa, Melissa Peoples to 15 years in prison. Dr. Najee K. Ruse was killed when Melissa Peoples struck him with her BMW while he was riding his bicycle. Jaffney Gray at the sentencing and has the family's strong and emotional response to Peoples' apology. Financial. Two weeks ago, Melissa Peoples stood before our cameras with one message to the family of Dr. Najee K. Ruse. How terribly sorry. I am for all of this. I did not feel that apology was sincere at all. Peoples was driving drunk when she struck and killed Kay Ruse while he was riding his bike back in 2019. We have suffered for 1,044 days and will suffer forevermore. Today, Peoples was found guilty on both counts of intoxication manslaughter and failure to stop and render aid. Face to face with Peoples, the K. Ruse family did not hold back. No situation forces a person to get behind a wheel drunk. You chose to gamble with your life and more selfishly with others. You left the scene and tortured us for three years. During victim impact statements, the family spoke about how great of a man K. Ruse was. He saved lives. You took a life. Like grasping a rose with thorns, that memory of my dad is beautiful, but it comes with pain. They also spoke on the severity of drunk driving. For God's sake, she was a repeat offender. When does this carnage stop? Most of all, they expressed how a 15-year sentence with the possibility of parole is not justice to them. Your consequence is but a raindrop compared to the flood we are drowning in. Melissa Peoples will now serve 15 years in the Texas Department of Corrections, but with credited time served and good behavior, she'll be up for parole in the next few years. Now to look back on the full victim impact statements from the family of Najee Kairouz, you can visit the story on our website at ksat.com. At the Kadena Reeves Justice Center, Jaffney Gray, KSAT 12 News.